Praise the Lord. Well, let me stop real quickly and tell you who these guys are back here behind me before we go any further and introduce you to the greatest bunch of guys in the whole wide world. I want to let you know a little bit more about them. I briefly introduced them to you a minute ago. I'll start with the young man back here behind all these drums. If you can see him back here, I've known this young man, as some of you know, his whole life. And the reason why is because he's my oldest son. I'm tickled to have one of my boys on the road with me, Ricky's. Yeah, amen. Ricky's already been involved in gospel music now for almost 10 years. He's on all the Gaither Kids videos. So if you've seen have any of those for your children or grandchildren, you've seen old Ricky acting and singing and having a great old time. Of course, he likes me to tell everybody that was back when he was a whole lot younger. He's 18 now, and I think he's the greatest drummer in gospel music. Y'all make Ricky free. Welcome here tonight, if you will. Playing the piano over here from Rogersville, Alabama, and actually Michael is from a little town called Toonerville, Alabama. Now, is there any Alabama folks here tonight? We got about five or six of you. Okay, so y'all are still greatly outnumbered. See, we have in the group, we have four Georgia guys and two Alabama guys. So needless to say, the Alabama guys are greatly outnumbered and they're always getting a hard time. And uh, Michael, we always tell Alabama jokes. And Michael came to me not too long ago and asked me if I'd kind of lay off of the Alabama jokes, at least from stage. And I asked him why. He said, I have reason to be proud of being from the state of Alabama. I said, what could that possibly be? He said, the man that invented the toothbrush was from the state of Alabama. That's what he said. Then I went on to tell him, well, had it been invented in any other state, it would have been called a teeth brush. Some of y'all get that later on tonight. It'll kick in. And you'll just laugh and laugh. But now, Michael also comes from a family with a history in gospel music. I know most of you, maybe all of you, know who Jake Hess is. Well, Michael and Jake are cousins. That'll tell you a little bit about his family. Everybody in his family can sing or play. They're just a talented bunch. Mike's no different. One of the greatest keyboard players you'll ever hear. One of the nicest guys you'll ever meet. Y'all make Michael Camp welcome here tonight, if you would. Singing lead all the way from a South Georgia town by the name of Tifton, Georgia. Now, Tifton's a pretty good size. I think probably one of the finest lead singers in Southern gospel music. Thank the finest lead singer in Southern Gospel Music. Y'all make Mr. Bill Shivers welcome here tonight. Give Bill a hand. Singing there called another South Georgia man. Now this man's from a town called Wiggum, Georgia. Now Wiggum, Georgia's a very small place too. You got any money? I don't care what you say. I guarantee you'll never hear a finer baritone singer, meter nicer guy in gospel music than Mr. Craig Singletary. Y'all make Craig welcome here tonight. Come here, Tiny. Singing bass. You can already tell that this is one more bass singing machine. Now, this is our other Alabama guy. Bill is from Hartsell, Alabama, which is also at the northwestern corner of Alabama. So when I tell the Alabama joke, I stand a long way for this man for obvious reasons. I would want him to get a hold of me. But now, but now we have, let me go ahead and tell you this. We have two guys in a group named Bill. So this won't confuse you. You can do the very same thing that we do. We have what we refer to singing lead over here as Little Bill. We have what we refer to here singing bass as Big Bill. And that's how we keep them apart on the bus. You can call them Little Bill and Big Bill if you want to. They won't get mad. Not too awful bad anyway. But I guarantee you'll never hear a finer bass singer and all of gospel music, a meter nicer guy than Mr. Bill Lawrence. Y'all make Bill welcome here tonight. Yeah, I was just wondering, does anybody here know what his nickname is? <laughs> precious. You know, I've been called a lot of things in my lifetime, but Precious ain't one of them. From Atlanta, Georgia, the most awarded tenor in all of Southern Gospel music, are you glad to see Brian Free? 